Okay, guys. So, as you know, I'm Ben. So, today, like right now, as we, sp as like we spoke, 15 minutes ago. Currently, it is 12:45 in the morning, and I delivered it at 12:30. So, this is the story of the first time I snuck out. So, look, I was on a call with my cousin. Because he wanted to pay girl attack. And then, my friend, my other friend's number calls. So then, he asked me, Hey, my sister and her friend really need water. So I said, You really want me to go out in the middle of the night? But the thing is, if my mom would have woke up, she would have got in a panic. So then, I have a big conversation with him, like, do you really want me to go out in the middle of night? So as you know, I obviously agree with my dumbass. So then after that, I start walking. But first, if my mom ever woke up, I put a balloon under a, a, a balloon under a, what's it called? A blanket. That way it looked like I'm sleeping. Now, after that, I went outside. And as I was walking, there was light. Because I said, hey man, can you flash the light? So of course he does it. And as you know, the conversation got pretty weird. Because my friend Matt said, Oh, Tierra's friend, Taylor, that's her name. Wants me to tell you that I want her that he she wants to. He wants she want he wants that I want that she wants me to come in her mouth and I'm like, excuse me, like C U M come, and I'm like, what the fuck? And he says I'm just joking. So as you know, they're asking me for water, and in the middle of the night, I've had to bring two waters. Because they're thirsty ass. <coughs> yeah. In the middle of the night, they asked me to go. And I did. They were camping in their backyard for some fucking reason. So then, I tell them, okay, I'll go. So then, I go. And then, midway, there's like red flashes, white flashes. So midway, I hear something from the bushes, because I live, the, the only way I can get through their house without the cops noticing me is through the alleyway. Let me tell you something about the alleyway. That's the most drug dealish, fucking dirtiest place you would ever see in Texas. So then, I go. Midway, I see something black, like in, like where a fence is. I went to go shine my goddamn light and there was a fucking possum and i'm not talking a little baby one a big ass one ones that look like a fucking trapper keeper so then so then so then sorry it's my cousin in the background so then i run my ass and as i run i trip and let me tell you that possum Literally bit my fucking um, pants, but it didn't bite my leg. It didn't even come close. It bit my pants. So I had to run to my friend's house, give them the damn water. And when I go back, there's literally three to two possums waiting for me. So you know what I had to do? I ran my sorry ass back to the house. And made sure to lock all those damn doors. But as soon as I got home, my mom was like, Sam, what time is it? And I'm glad I came home at a really good time. That way she didn't notice that I was gone. That was my first time sneaking out. It was the scariest, not scariest night. It was just pretty fun. And, yeah. Anyways, guys, have a good day. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Turn on that notification bell. And have a good day.